One of the greatest players in the history of Austin P. football, Jay Bailey, who in just three short seasons ripped through the governor's record book just like he did opposing defenses. After his senior season in 2002, Bailey was named First Team Associated Press and American Football Coaches Association 1AA All-American. He was also chosen First Team Mid-Major All-America and First Team All-America by the Football Gazette. Bailey was named the 2002 Pioneer Football South Offensive Player of the Year and helped lead the Govs to their first winning season since 1984. Along the way, he broke many APSU rushing records, including the career mark at that time with his 2,992 career rushing yards. Jay Bailey combined power and great speed to emerge as the Govs' best player during the non-scholarship era. Jay, even at Austin P, uh, that I witnessed, was never caught from behind once he got loose. And there's not many, there's some fast guys that can't make that claim. And I always thought Jay was one of those guys that was faster in pads than he, than he was maybe on a track. Well, he got a good work ethic. You know, he practiced his art. He watched a lot of great running backs at the time when we was growing up. He was always the first one there, you know, and he just studied, worked on his body and got himself to the state where he could be the best he could be. This is the story of Jay Bailey. Jay Bailey grew up in the shadow of his older brother and fellow Austin P. Hall of Famer Trenton Hassel, who after a stellar career at Austin P. played nine years in the NBA. The two played together at Clarksville High School, but also had many one-on-one -on -one battles. But I think it helped both of us because our dad was always wor working and it was just us two. So we kind of looked out for each other, we pushed each other, we could yell at each other and not worried about anything else. So I think it helped both of us by pushing each other and knowing that we try to be better than the other one. Jay Bailey began his collegiate career on the basketball court at Volunteer State Community College, but after his freshman year, he transferred to Austin P to play football in 2000. In just eight games in his first season, Bailey rushed for 736 yards and six touchdowns. As a junior, he continued to battle injuries and gained 569 yards and scored seven touchdowns. It was in that 2001 season where Bailey began his assault on the Govs record book. Well, the game I remember was, I think I was playing in the NBA for Chicago. And I want to say they was playing a team in Indiana. I want to say it was Valparaiso or it was a team like that. And I was listening to the radio and uh, he ran back a 99 yard touchdown and they called it back. The next play, he ran it back even farther. So I was like, that's the, that, 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 that let me know that that was the moment that he could be something special. Bailey set the APSU record for the longest touchdown run from scrimmage that day of 99 yards. It was Jay Bailey's senior season in 2002 that set him apart from all other running backs in APSU history. He led all of 1AA football and was fourth best in the nation with 1,687 rushing yards with an average of 140 yards per game. Bailey had three straight 200-yard games and set the single season mark with 18 rushing touchdowns. He was also named second team Academic All-America that year. Jay Bailey's 2002 season was truly one of the most remarkable seasons in any sport in the history of Austin P. Athletics. He was just one of those guys that when he got in the open field, he was gone. And if not for an unfortunate uh, hamstring injury in the, in the combines, uh, I believe he would be playing in the NFL. If, if not today, he would have played for, for some years. Injuries may have cost Jay Bailey a shot at an NFL career, but he has certainly been a pro off the field, working with the youth in the Clarksville Montgomery County area at the YMCA. He now joins his brother again this time as a member of the Austin P Athletics Hall of Fame. When he found out, uh, I think he was almost in tears because, you know, he done did so much at Austin P, plus what he's doing now with younger kids at the Y. You know, he's helping people with, you know, the ability that God done blessed him with. I think it, it means a lot to him. 